invaded Mariupol. As the Russia-Ukraine war is approaching its second month, Russia announced the latest development. It was reported in the past days that the war had entered the second phase and Donba was besieged. According to the latest news, Russian Defense Minister Sergei Shigu informed President Vladimir Putin that Mariupol had been taken. As the Russia-Ukraine war is approaching its second month, last-minute statements came from Russia. He had recently reported that the war had entered the second phase and Donbass was besieged. While Russian forces tried to break through the defensive line along almost the entire front, Ukrainian officials described the situation as the second phase of the war. In today's breaking news, in the information given by Russian Defense Minister Sergei Shigu to Putin, he stated that they captured Mariupol. Russian Defense Minister Sergei Shigu told Putin that there are still Ukrainian fighters at the Azovstal plant in Mariupol. Shigu informed Putin that 1,478 fighters had surrendered. Shigu stated that nearly 2,000 Ukrainian soldiers were trapped in the Azovstal factory and that the factory was safely surrounded. It was reported that the Russian army, which declared war on Ukraine, lost about 21,000 soldiers, 172 aircraft, 151 helicopters and 829 tanks. The Ukrainian general staff made statements regarding the losses of the Russian army between February 24 and April 21. According to the statement, approximately 21,000 soldiers from the Russian army attacking Ukraine were killed, 172 Russian aircraft, 151 helicopters, 829 tanks, 2,118 armored vehicles, 393 cannons, 136 rocket launch systems and 67 air defense systems were destroyed. Russian forces also lost 1,508 vehicles, 8 ships and light speedboats, 76 fuel vehicles and 166 drones. In a statement made by the Russian Ministry of Defense on March 25, it was announced that 1,351 Russian soldiers died in Ukraine.